Shalom, call hello, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Let's give our praise to the Most High, name of His only begotten Son, name of the Holy Spirit. Double honors to our teachers, the elders, and the apostles of Great Millstone who taught us His truth and truth and sincerity. Peace and salutations to the hopeful like scattered abroad. Shalom, 144,000. My name is Akbar from the Prophets in Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And real quick, man, I ain't gonna make this long. Just going to get get I get out to get get these short little videos out the way. <clears throat> Going into what's going on on Earth right now, you know, a lot of things happening in China, and this is one of them. I went into this, you know, in December of last year, how to, how they were saying how this year is going to be the push for human humanoid robots, man. All right, was going into a little bit of that camp last week, you know, and how they want to have this, you know, in every store and every house, you know, these particular robots, you know, pretty much may, may, making them servants, which means that they won't no longer need you people. You know, predominantly you Jakes who do all these, you know, labor jobs. They, they, their goal is to, to not need you anymore and in hopes to get rid of you. All right. So let me read this uh, caption right here. It says Chinese robot production. Remember, with AI, robotics and driverless vehicles, the so-called elites have no more need for the masses. The WEF describes us all as useless eaters. Consider yourself, therefore, expendable. And that's what this is about. Uh, right. 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 Some of these robots, you can't even, you know, it's, 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 it's kind of hard to distinguish them from actual people. And this is what they want. And they may have these robots already walking amongst us. All right. And um, when, when, it, when when push comes to shove, they're going to use these this technology to bring great death and destruction upon you people. OK. And also to, to you know, not need you people. Like I said, predominantly, you so-called Negro, Spanish, Native Indians, because you're the ones that do all, do all the labor jobs. So let's go to 2 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 11. Let Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. We will see what this devil is doing. All right? We see, we see what you're doing. And ultimately, they want to, uh, you know, they're, they're pushing towards something. Okay? They have these different agendas. Agenda 2025, Agenda 2030. You know, you have Agenda 2021. They got plans. All right? And, and a part of these plans is to, is to get rid of the Israelites and, uh, you know, there, there goes your, your uh, jobs. Let me grab that too. All right. <clears throat> Let me grab that. Okay, because um, let's grab this in the NLT. As a matter of fact, because you know, with these, with this technology, that they won't need you to work anymore. Matter of fact, before I grab that, let me go here and play this other video. <laughs> And this is what we're going to need, that spiritual power, divine intervention, because, you know, the knowledge has been increased in this earth, man. These devils and got some type of technology you can't even imagine. It says China has learned a lot about drones from the Ukraine war. The next war is going to be very different. And we understand that the next world war is going to be, um, 
swarm drone warfare will be wild. Yeah, and they, they always use this stuff for, you know, warfare. We understand that the next world war is going to be through thermonuclear missiles. All right. They're going to that's going to be the great equalizer. OK, so let me go here real quick. <clears throat> Let's go to Ecclesiastes chapter 12, verse four. Nope. Let's go to verse three. It says, and I'll read it in the I'll read it in the KJV first, and I'll read it in NLT. Uh, Ecclesiastes chapter twelve, verse three. It says, "In the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble, and the strong men shall bow themselves, and the grinders cease, because they are few, and those that look out the windows be dark, and the future is looking very bleak for this place, man. It's looking very, very bleak. All right, there is no future for America. There is no future for the for even for these other countries. All right." But the grinders shall cease because there are few. Ain't gonna be no more workers. You're gonna close. They're closing up all these shops. You got the retail apocalypse. A lot of stores are shutting down. You know, a lot of uh, businesses are shutting down. You know, and you know this is all by design because at, at the end of the day, they, they really don't have any need for you people anymore. You know, hence you know the great you know uh, destruction that's about to come upon this place. Scripture says how um, Revelation 12 and 12, the devil shall come down against you having great wrath because he knows that he have but a short time. Esau knows that his time is short. So he's going to use all this technology and stuff. You know, you got DARPA, you know, they're going to use all that, all that technology to, 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 to seek to destroy you Israelites and, and, even, and even his own people. It says, and the door shall be shut in the streets when the sound of the grinding is low. And he shall rise up at the voice of the bird, and all the daughters of music shall be brought low. So it ain't gonna be, it ain't gonna, ain't gonna be no more, you know, having a good time and partying and enjoying yourself. This it, it, it place is through. And NLT it says in verse three, remember him before your legs, the guards of your house start to tremble. Mm. People are gonna be terrified. It says and before your shoulders, the strong men stoop. Remember him before your teeth, your few remaining servants. Stop grinding, which means which means working. And before your eyes, the woman looking through the windows see dimly. All right. So see, remember your how about Shemuel Shai. Come back to how about Shemuel Shai. Okay. It says, remember him before the doors of so lucky before the doors to life's opportunities is closed and the sound of work fades. Right. And you, you know, I'm at the plantation now. But oftentimes you hear me in my videos, you hear a bunch of com commotion in the back. That's the sound of grinding. OK, I'll, I'll work in a warehouse and you know, there's always you know, a bunch of noise grinding from machines and, you know, people using, you know, power tools and stuff. That's the sound of work. But that's going to fade. All right. And, you know, it's crazy, too, because at my job, every now and then we'll have like a little short a, a power outage. You know, the power go out for, you know, a, a couple of seconds to a minute. You know, and then all the music, all the noise just stops. And I hear, you know, everybody, you know, you hear, you hear, you hear people, you know, but you don't hear any, hear any machinery. So that's the time we're coming into. Okay. It says, remember, remember him before the doors, the door to life's opportunity is closed and the sound of work fades. Now you rise at the first chirping of the bird. Um, but then all their sounds will grow faint. You see? So it's gonna get very, very ugly out here, and this, and this is what what you what, what it was coming, what you seen in that video, which I'm gonna make make some shorts out of those clips. That's a part of it, man. Okay, it's about to get very uh, uh uncomfortable out here, and they show you that's in all these sci-fi movies, of um, you know these robots, you know taking over iRobot. You got this movie called uh, Mother Android, which is a good movie to watch. You know where they have these robots, you know um. In mass production around society and working in society, and then they end up turning on the people, you know, uh, Terminator Genesis. Okay, so we live in, in in a world where you know, um, you know, a, all these things is uh, you know, it it is it, really already in your face. Let me go here. <coughs> what is it? Yep, it says Second Ezra chapter five verse uh, one. It says, nevertheless, as coming the tokens, you know, the signs, behold, the day shall come that they which dwell upon the earth shall be taken in great number. And a lot of people are about to lose their lives because they don't have need for you people anymore. OK, they their, their goal is to depop. OK, that's why they're poisoning you every single day. I saw a video actually last night, I believe, where um, I believe it was in Tennessee. They had banned, you know, uh, those chemtrails from being sprayed on them. 
and they and, and they haven't had chem, the skies look completely different the skies went back to normal okay they haven't had chemtrails in, in 30 days they said so everybody should do that but we know that you know it's the lord's will for these things to happen it says and the way of truth shall be hidden and the land shall be buried of faith so it's gonna get ugly out here man you know they, they know they, they're gonna um they're gonna bring in you know the 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 internet of things you know the famine of hearing the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh. They're gonna cut these pages off. They're gonna they're gonna shut everything down. All right. You got it now. Where Esau, you know, we do these videos in Esau. Like I, you know, they, they they'll strike you in the middle of the night. You sleep, and they going through your page trying to find something to strike, man. Which I just came off came off of a strike. You see, and it's for an old video, man. An old video that I ain't even really even you know, I ain't, I ain't even titled it, man. Somebody else did, but they'll strike you for for these for these videos and try to get this, you know. To get this thing out of the way, so they can bring in their their, their thing, you see. So what's, what's going to happen is the Lord is going to really, uh, you know, do 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 away with this man. But before we get to that point where this man is done away with, we're gonna be in hell, bro. Okay, we're gonna be in hell on this earth. It's gonna be you know some some trying times for sure. All right, so just be mindful, you know, stay in the spirit, you know, uh, be alert. <laughs> you know, you, you never know who's sitting next to you on the damn bus or something. You know, it could be a whole Android, and and you know they got Terminators. You know, which I want to go into that too. With China, they got these invisible cloaks now. You know, they could put it on armor and stuff. I want to go into that too. So that's why I kind of kept this one short because I got another video I want to do. That's probably gonna be a part two to this. But I pray be edifying to the whole elect. Shalom, Kama Sharala, of Baba Ball, double honor to my teachers, the elders, and apostles, the great millstone. I'm gonna let you hear it real quick. This is the sound of grinding. You hear it? Machines turn on. <laughs> Everything whirling up. This is the sound of grinding. Well, this is going to be brought low, and then everybody going to know, you know. Whatever, something to shout along. Come sure I love Bob.